Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I want to do the review for 2014 uh, Audi uh, A4 um, Premium Plus. So this is the um, I know I know this is not the JDM. This is the um, USDM. Um, I just cut that one, and um, I really like this car. And um, so I just you know I'm driving it. And I just want to do some review about it. So, so here I am doing it. So this is the Audi A4 2014 uh, Premium Plus S Line version, a Quattro. So basically, it has 2.0 liter um, four-cylinder turbo engine. You know, just like the uh, the Audi uh, corporate engine, because they've been do doing this engine for like so long. For this model. Audi um, A4 is start change the the new styling change from 2013. So it's just a 2014. It doesn't change much outside, but the uh, engine power it boosts like nine horsepower more than 2013. So this is now two boots like 220 horsepower, four cylinder turbo engine. Um, the torque is around like 258 pound of torque on about like uh, 2000 rpm so it's just a low end torque is pretty good so it's it's it feels solid when you want to when you drive i feel like um it's it seems more faster than it it seems it is <laughs> so um yeah it just it's kind of photo family entry level luxury sports car segment you know it's direct competitor for the uh mercedes c300 and um a bmw 3 series so they are they're very uh, similar on the side, but I, I have a BMW uh, a 320i also, so which is about the same side, but I feel like Audi has more room and more, um, it, I feel like the wheelbase is a little longer and I like the uh, more um, uh, room in the in, inside. So let's uh, let's talk about this one. So this is the, um, the Premium Plus version, but as you can see, this is an S-Line. So it has um, Xeno headlights. I think sport suspension and um and a little bit of body uh styling makes it a little different probably like a, it's not the size cut but maybe the uh the front end looks a little bit different than regular audi i mean they do have like a regular premium which comes with the uh, halogen lights and i don't think they have front lights but this is the um uh, it's a nice very really good looking like a uh, uh, led daytime running lights and the led fog light as well so it's uh it's pretty nice i believe and uh, the Wii is uh, it looks uh, different than the uh, uh, the uh, regular uh, uh, premium model. So is this a premium plus uh, S line? So you can see the batch of the S line. So let's talk about this car. So this this car has a um, when I bought it, it's 99,900 99, something miles, and now it's hundred thousand miles. So hundred thousand and two hundred miles, three hundred miles, something like that. But since this car has no issue at all, it just seems very solid build um, I have no like um, issue with the check engine lights or anything the cars run smooth and the paint looks really nice I like this the shiny black um, uh, colors and does have the um, LED front lights LED um, and, the, and the back light as well um, yeah it is quattro but somehow I don't see the batch here it's, it's supposed to be like 2.0 T quattro but it doesn't but it shows inside though but like as you can see that the, the on the sunlight so you can see like um, how good the paint it is and uh, it comes with the uh, navigation and it's come with comes with the um, um, BNO I believe yeah BNO um, uh, audio system uh, 14 speaker uh, 550 I believe 550 watts sounds amazing <laughs> it sounds really nice so uh, yeah let's take a look inside so this is 10 years old car 2014, so now 2024 is 10. So there's a little scratch here and there. Uh, as you can see, the fender here, a little bit of scratch, but it's not very noticeable. It looks very nice on this car. I believe this car has an uh, all-weather package. So you can see the uh, headlight washer down here. Uh, it comes with the uh, heated seat um, for the both side, uh, power seat, power memory seat, navigation. It's pretty much like all the uh, equipments from, you know, as you can expect it, uh, from German made, right? So yeah the car looks amazing let's uh, take a look inside i'll show you the show you the interior so you can see here and the um 
um, memory seed. It's set as line package here in the, in the power uh, driver seat. I like the this, this, the steering wheel a lot. It looks uh, much really nicer than the old one. I, I somehow I feel like I like that one than um, the three spoke uh, steering wheel. So here, the engine start stop button is here, and then you know the funny thing is I couldn't find the audio buttons anywhere here, but this audio buttons, the volume buttons are here. Though. So radio, media, back, and there's a full button here, but there's no um, no um, sign of uh, things here. But I, when I start it, then then you can see it on the navigation screen. All right, let's start. Let's start the engine. Oh, where's my? Oh, there you go. So here you can see that hundred thousand and two hundred one miles. It makes a really annoying sound. So let me up uh, close this door. Oh, it's just gonna keep beeping it. Anyway, so this is how the um, the uh, instrument cluster looks like. And um, well, let's do the uh, radio here. And here's navigation. So here's the navigation system. And um, down here it said all the all the multimedia. When I open it. Well, there's a two SD card slot and the SIM card slot, <laughs> so it's kind of like funny if you want like a high quality sound. You know, I mean they do have a Bluetooth connection, so it, you can use it Bluetooth. And um, if you have a like a B3 or something that you can put in your SD card and you can just put in the SD card. It's really cheap now. And um, here's and the dashboard is has the nice uh, soft touch everywhere, and there's aluminium, not really aluminium, but it's the like like aluminium style. Um, it's a quattro here, and there's a dash. Um, the yeah, glove compartment files it's come with the uh, um, all the um, uh, here is the uh, oh, see, so that so that the um, the the door lock unlock button is right there. See that? Yep, and there's a speaker for totally 14 speaker. I, I don't know how they calculate it. There's a one here, and one here, and a one in the middle. And then there's uh, one here, one down here. Anyway, um, also this is another um, storage. Probably looks like a, a secret lighter or something. And it does have this uh, armrest, which you can just move it forward or move it down. And it comes with the, uh, oh, there's another secret lighter plus down here. And uh, it's really nice um um what do you call it very comfy but it is um it's huck your body on this um leather seat and uh, there's a more roof here and the good thing is like well like funny thing is like you can have to open like this to to open the more roof but well, that's the way it is i guess the sound the, uh, the jumping engineering looks like and here's a bag there's a plenty of space in the back it's pretty nice. Um, let me uh, open the hood and I'll open the uh, trunk and uh, I will show you around there. All right. This is how they open the hood and this is how you open the trunk. I'll just keep beeping this on. <laughs> and uh, so in the rear seat, it looks really great. Look at, look at the inside. It is amazing that the, um, the, the, the owner kept it very well so this is a two owner car it has a minor accidents on the carfax but it uses just a minor and probably there's some scratch down here there but the inside looks great it's good condition so here's the trunk it is um, not too bad i mean it's just a small segment car you know entry level but the uh, the uh, it's about like i think 12 cubic feet or something um down here the spare tires and uh, it's a good size, good size for the car. Also, let me uh, show you the, uh, oh, this is we, the, the alloy we have some scrap down here, but yeah, it's 10 years of car, right? And here's on the passenger side, the inside looks super clean. It looks like a new car to me, you know, even though it's just 2014, it looks great. Um, 
and uh, this is here you know it i i wish i could show you in a one is uh, darker and you can see the like a lights coming here like this it, it looks really nice uh, yeah, let me show you the engine the engine looks pretty clean also so you can see the like 2.0 liter four cylinder engine which um, running very good i don't even hear the noise or anything but yeah so pretty nice car so just uh let me know what you guys think of you know um appreciate it that you're watching my um channels and i i'll have more stuff to upload i'm gonna do all the uh jdm i keep doing the jdm i do have skylights coming in so i'm gonna have to do the skyline in a couple weeks uh but in the meantime i'm just gonna do all the cars that i have right now to to have you know review for all the cars all right guys really appreciate it thanks for watching it please subscribe my channels and please leave the comments if you have anything thank you so much